Hey guys, and welcome back to Sommer. I was going to call that the set, but I'm actually really curious to see what happens if we keep going. So, let's keep going. Now, I wonder what the fuck we're going to find in here. Service area. Offline. What a crazy part that last was. I mean, we... I don't know if the WoW's dead. I don't know. I sure as shit don't know if we're gonna have creatures here. We need to heal as well. Chris, what the hell happened to your arm? It's complicated. I just need to know one thing. <laughs> I'll have both my arms in the arc, right? Yes, of course. Are you okay though? Can you do stuff? Yeah. Let's just get this over with. Did you find the arc? I did, but I kind of lost it on my way here on an automated tram thing headed to Phi. So it should be around somewhere. That's great. Let's go get it. Let's go get it. Ooh. You mean, can I go and get it, please? The answer right. would be yes. Up and running. Now, is there anywhere to heal? What have we got here? Sight map. Storage. So we're here, so we need to go to that. A satellite is loaded into a shell. The shell is accelerated by electromagnets along the barrel. Enough momentum to escape Earth's gravity is gained before aggression. Reaching space, the satellite will shed the shell and unfold. Onboard thrusters settle the satellite into an orbit. Yep. Sounds pretty basic and standard, and a very, very cheap way of uh, getting satellites into space. <sighs> I guess everybody's dead. Um, so these are all the satellites. Mission complete. Mission complete. Mission complete. Communications, remote sensing, reconnaissance. weather satellite. After 10 years of impeccable operation, the Omega space gun will shut down. But it took an apocalypse to be made redundant. Huh. Only operational for 10 years. After 10 years. Did you find out what happened to the Ark team? Not really. For some reason they didn't go through with the launch, so they took the Ark back to Tau. I hope everything's okay with the space gun. Yeah, I doubt I'll be able to repair one of those. Yeah, especially uh, with only having one arm. Can we talk to her? No. Uh, service area. That's where we came in from. Loading deck. Hello, monsters! Oh, God. This feels like the longest day of my life. Has it just been one day? I have no idea. Our time together is a confusing patchwork of moments to me. What time is it then? What day? It's May 11th, 2104, 3.30 a.m., but I don't remember when we started. Hmm. Oh, there's the arc. Main generators. Uh, oh no, it's, no, that's not the arc. That's just some other satellite, I assume. Oh, you know, health. I woke up in my bed today. It just happens to have happened. Sounds like a riddle. It does. I woke up in my bed today, a hundred years ago. <laughs> Who am I? Who am I? Yeah. Uh, you drive yourself mad with uh, questions and thoughts like that, Simon. It's just. 
Best not to think about it and just get on and hope for the best. It's crazy to think where I am. Not only is this the future, it's in the middle of the sea. I know nothing of this time or what the world looks like. Not much to brag about now. Before the comet, I guess it was okay. Yeah. Better not oversell it. Might change my mind about the Ark. You're seriously <laughs> not going to tell me what happened to your arm? I had to make a quick stop at Site Alpha to help kill the WoW. What? How? Why? Stop it from torturing the memory of humanity. Okay, let's just get back to work. <laughs> Are you suggesting we keep it down here? Doesn't that defeat the whole purpose? Eternity among the stars, remember? The people inside the Ark won't know the difference. We can just keep it down here, and we don't have to risk the Ark being shot through 5,000 meters of broken barrel, and then push through another 100,000 meters of a dust-filled atmosphere. Mm. Will the casing stand all that pressure? Well, the odds aren't great. Catherine, say something. I don't care what you think. I'm launching it. No need to be like that. Let's just hang on to it for a while and think about it. We can launch it later. No, that wasn't the deal. We needed to save them, to launch it. Out there, it's hope. Down here, it's a fucking terrarium waiting to die with the rest of us. Come on, yep. Catherine. It's not asking much. Let's just think about it before we risk the only hope humanity has to survive this hell. No, we launch it today. This is my project, my arc. It's bigger than that. Don't you get it? It's not for you to decide. We're talking about the fate of mankind. Get away from the arc. I'm taking it. No, you're not. I'm not gonna let you ruin this. Stop it! Guys, calm down! Get away from me! No! What the fuck did you do? It was an accident. Catherine, talk to me. Catherine! Holy God. shit. Catherine. Did you say something? It's you. You had an accident. What are you? Oh. You mean Catherine. Don't worry, it's better this way. Holy shit, she made it so far. So far, and she was so close. Ah, damn. So where are we meant to be going? I think I found the assembly space. What do you see? It's like a huge open shell, a bullet ready to be loaded. That's great. All prepared for the Ark. Right. I'll go pick it up. Yeah, about that. How we're did you die? You got into a fight with your colleagues. They didn't want to risk launching the Ark. Thought I might not make it through the atmosphere. They killed me? I'm sure it was an accident. They were just trying to stop you from launching. Oh, battery. Um. How could they kill me? Catherine. I know I'm not in this place, like, I just thought they trusted me. Come on, don't do this to yourself. Okay, so we have a battery. Where does the battery need. Oh, well, it needs to go here, I guess. There were some. Jesse, Sean. Ah, oh, there it is. I always wanted a friend. Like a real one. Someone you'd never hold back with. I'll hmm. be your friend. Oh, pity friendship? Now I feel even worse. We all want real friends, my dear. There. Do you think the Ark will make you it through the atmosphere and into and space? Far between. It almost doesn't matter anymore. We just need to try. If we burn, we burn. If we're lucky... We just gave humanity a new chance, a whole new era. With the Ark on Earth, maybe we have a few decades of power to keep it running. In space, we have thousands of years. Still, one hell of a gamble, though. This was never about certainty. It's about hope. Yeah, I get what you're saying. I do. Um, and I, I actually agree with you, Catherine. This is the last thing we have left to do. 
No monsters here yet, which is curious. I'm not complaining. Um, that's not where. Where were we? We were through. Yeah. Um, what will you do when you get into the ark? What's the first thing? Make sure the ark is safe. Stabilize flight path. Activate solar panels. What's the first human thing you're gonna do? Oh. Watch the clouds roll by. Does that count? Yes, it I'd does. So. That absolutely counts. Is that it? I'm really not that familiar with guns of any size. Oh, here we go. All systems say go. Lock and load. Oh, this is, so, this is actually really exciting. Okay, I kind of want to watch it be loaded. Let's hope there's enough juice in this bad boy. I mean, holy crap trying to think about how much power and energy it would take to fire this thing. Come on, buddy. You're almost there, my friend. You're almost there. Right, now, what do we fiddle with? Now what? Now we just need to get the shell into the gun and then... Kaboom. Aren't you forgetting uh, something? How are you going to get us on board the Ark? Don't we need to make another scan? Oh, don't you worry. You don't operate something like the Omega Space Gun with your bare hands. You mean, it's a pilot seat? Like back at Omicron? Yes, and we can use it to transfer you to the Ark while operating the gun. Two birds and all that. Now, take the Omni tool and plug yeah, it um, the seat and <clears throat> I'll guide you through the final steps. Catherine? I don't trust that. I, uh, I think this is all, I do, yeah, launch them. I don't trust that. I think you're going to make another copy of me. And I'm going to be stuck here. And Simon, you can't possibly be expecting anything different. Surely. Really? We're filling with water? Okay. We good? We good? There we go. Oh. Okay. There's not ex Oh. Um. All right. I'll never get used to that. Not expecting it to look like to. this. Not after this is over. Right. Have a seat. Yes, Simon, work it out, mate. As good as it's gonna get. Okay, I'll activate the seat. You should be able to use the machines to load the bullet you assembled. Um, and how do I do that? How do you operate this thing? Don't know, I never tried this one. But pilot seats are notoriously easy to use, so it shouldn't be a problem. Right. Oh, Jesus. Um,. Oh, I see. So we just pick that up like that. And... Oh. Where does that go? Zoom, frame. Does it go in there? Can't go in there. Where are... Well, ah, I see. 
back. Um, oh, there we go. There we go. Score going there. No? Where was that? Oh. Come on, baby. It's right here somewhere. Come on. Okay, this is incredibly fiddly. I wish we could have a better angle. Was that out here somewhere? Well, that doesn't make any sense. Oh. There we go. That was quite fiddly, actually. There we go. Okay, ready when you are. Just hit the button and we're off. But we need to transfer our minds to the Ark. We also need to make sure it launches it all, so I tied them to a single switch. Just push the button and we're off. Ah, uh, yeah, Simon. You're a dull lad, Simon. Here we go. Now turn in back. Thank you, Simon. You don't mention. It's an amazing thing you did. And I want you to know I appreciate it. Time. 20 seconds. What's the matter with the upload? Just give it a second. I thought you guys would have better bandwidth in the future. Yeah. Uh-oh. Already see what's happening here. 10 seconds. 9. 8. Nope. 7. 6. No way. Five, 4. No way. Just before Work it out, buddy. Yeah, I saw. Then why are we still here? Simon, I can't keep telling you how it works. You won't listen. You know why we're here. You were copied onto the Ark. You just didn't carry over. You lost the coin toss. We both did. Just like Simon and Omicron. Just like the man who died in Toronto a hundred years ago. This is bullshit. We came all this way. We launched the Ark. I know it sucks. But our copies are up there. Catherine and Simon are both safe on the Ark. Be happy for them. Are you crazy? We're gonna die down here with those fuckers living at large on a spaceship. They're not us. They're not us. They I'm kind of feel that way, Simon. Uh... I'm proud of what we did. We made sure that something of the hundreds of thousands of years of human history survived, that something lives on. No, 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 no. Fuck this. Fuck. Fuck this. Fuck you. Fuck you, Catherine, you lied. And I believed in you, I trusted you. You said we're getting on the fucking Ark. We are on the Ark, you idiot. I didn't lie. I can't be responsible for your goddamn ignorance. Fuck! Catherine? Please don't leave me alone. Catherine? Catherine? That is horrendous. That is absolutely horrendous. But I kind of saw that coming. Oh man. Oh man. What a 
game. Oh my god. How bleak. What an absolute tragic end. Now here's the thing, right? I've uh, read a few things about what people have said about the ending. Now, I haven't read any spoilers, and I certainly didn't know what was going to happen. But, I knew a lot of people didn't like the ending of the game. A lot of people have told me that the end of this game is rubbish. I would just like to take this time to disagree. I thought that was fantastic. It was obvious. It's kind of strange that Simon still didn't get the fact or didn't get the, the, the whole point that he wasn't going to be magically transferred into the Ark. He was just going to get copied. Um, I it's kind of... I guess blind hope he was running on, I suppose. Now, the thing with Catherine is she... She basically only told him once, and once uh, she obviously saw how like upset he got about uh, the whole situation. She was just nodding and agreeing with him, basically. She, she wasn't lying to him, but she wasn't reminding him of the truth as well. You know, for obvious reasons, because if he'd known the truth, he wouldn't have completed the journey. Um... But yeah, man, that game makes you think. My God. Superb work. I still say the game would have been just as good without the monsters. Um, because they were more of a hindrance than anything else. But wow. I, I also as well, if I must say... Hello. Hello. Oh. Whoa. Is this... Did it work? Um... I guess it did. Holy shit, look at this! Oh my god, yes. So... Let's not talk about the other... Simon that's left back on Earth. Oh my god. As beautiful this is, you can really see the, uh, the the engine struggling here a bit. It's a good looking game, but it's not that amazing. But wow. How nice is this in comparison to every? Do we get to see everybody else? Oh, I hope so. Oh man, this is actually pretty incredible now I understand why people would be disappointed at the ending because um, now again I don't know exactly why they didn't like the ending but I'm assuming it's because Simon did not get transferred um, into the Ark like Simon himself was expecting but as the as the gamer the guy or girl playing this game you would know that's not the way it works. Welcome. If you're reading this, you have successfully entered the Ark. This survey is designed to give the developers a better understanding of your uh, subjective experience and how to improve your well-being. Please continue with the survey. Um, I feel invigorated because we're here. We're alive. We're happy. Uh, how would you describe your mental condition? I feel normal. How would you describe your senses? I expect it as normal. How would you describe the sensation of your new condition? It's fucking pleasant. After the shit that we've been through, it's pleasant. Are you troubled by the fact that you're no longer strictly human? Uh, we are so over that. We are so over that. 
Um, I don't care what form I take as long as I get to carry on. Eh, no. We're going to go with no. I feel fine. How do you perceive your new existence? It is a direct continuation of my previous self, which it is. However, it's more like um, you're just splitting the timeline because other Simon is still sitting in that. That's yeah. yeah we <clears throat> we said we wouldn't talk about him, didn't we? Uh, yeah. Do you think this new existence will be a life worth living? Yes, just as much. Would you rather be removed from this project and accept death? Um, no. No. Let's have a little look around. Feels like I'm playing in a way Oblivion or something. And it's so peaceful here. The ambience here is oh my god. <gasps> is that Catherine. her? I can't believe we actually made it. Well we did. I'm so relieved. It's okay, Simon. Everything's alright now. The last bastion of humanity. Where's everyone else, though? Wasn't there, like, <clears throat> lots of other people on board? Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Now, I did read, uh, read, read, I did read, um, a long time ago, actually, before I decided 100% I was going to play this game. Um, someone said at the end of this game that you fail. And for a long time, I was like, hmm. So I was half expecting something to go wrong here. But I guess nothing does go wrong. I do kind of want to know what happens to Simon. I guess he's left. Oh, man, think of that's two polar opposites there, isn't it? You've got one guy that's ascended to, quote, heaven. And then you've got somebody else down the end. Uh, somebody else that's down in, in literal hell. It's a broken body. He's alone in the dark, underwater. That is nightmare fuel with all those creatures and things. But I really enjoyed that game, guys. And I hope you enjoyed it with me. Thank you for coming along for the journey. And as always, until next time.